Welcome to another AWS Super match. Last time we saw Sal from Empathical Jokers fight Santa Claus, and Santa Claus won, so the next match will be Awesome Man versus Santa. But today's match is going to be Chris Hansen versus Donald Trump. That's right, the man who catches predators is going to be fighting a predator. That is not a controversial statement at all, and this will not be a biased match at all. Both of those statements I just made are absolutely wrong. It's absolutely a biased match. I'm rooting for Chris Hansen all the way. And that, that was absolutely a controversial statement because I'm pretty sure I just lost every single Trump supporter who is possibly subscribed to me. Which I highly doubt any of them were. Well, maybe a few were. I don't know. But yes, today's match will be Chris versus Donald. We're going to see who will win. The Predator or the Hunter, I guess. Because, you know, hunters, they can catch predators sometimes if they're, you know, like poachers and whatnot. We don't support poaching here at AWS. I just... Let's just move on with the match, guys. Oh, I just hit the mic. I'm very professional. Oh, yeah, a little bit of news I just want to give you guys. Uh, the stay-at-home order here uh, where me, Philip, and Communist are, uh, it's, it's about to be lifted here soon. I think it got lifted today, actually. So we're going to start hanging out with each other again. I can't... Guarantee we're going to go right back into regular AWS episodes instantly. We're going to ease back into it, you know, just hang out for a little bit, see if it's safe for us. But yes, but I will say this. If we do get back into regular episodes before this tournament ends, then it, this tournament will keep going. I'm not ending this. I'm going to finish this whole storyline I have going on with Awesome Man. But anyway, back to the match. In walks Chris Hansen himself. And I want to tell you guys a little funny story about Chris Hansen. So, out of character, me and Captain Communist, when we hang out, sometimes we like to watch episodes of To Catch Predator and Hansen vs. Predator, which is basically the same show, but newer. Because, you know, we like to get a good laugh out of it, get a good, get a good laugh about, out of uh, how the Predators react to seeing Chris Hansen just appear and catch them. One guy, when he went to the, to the uh, quote-unquote little girl's house, he went to the bathroom because he had to use the bathroom first, I guess. And when he poked his head out of the bathroom, he asked, Where's the light, where's the light switch? And he looked for looked forward in the kitchen and just saw Chris Hansen. And the look on his face, it was, it was pure gold. Pure gold. So I have a question for you in the comment section. If you were just at home one day and you had to go use the, just doing your own thing, and you went to go use the bathroom, and you came back out, walked into your room, Turned on the light and just found Chris Hansen just standing at the edge of your bed, just giving you his Chris Hansen look. How would you react? How would you feel? What would thought process? What thoughts would go through your head? Me, I'd be like, "Oh God, did he? Did he find the? Did he find this weird stuff I'm into? I swear to God, Chris Hansen, they're not actually teens. The video calls them teen. The title of the video calls them te teens, but they're not really teens. They're really porn stars in like their early to mid twenties. I swear to God." Porn videos do that all the time, Chris. I swear I'm not a pedophile. I know what you're thinking. TMI, Super Zack Thunder, TMI. Well, you know what? That's a that's AWS in a nutshell. TMI. We should change our acronym to that. Not AWS, TMI. Because we, re we reveal a lot of weird shit about ourselves in this show. Let's be real here. Oh, and the match begins instantly with Donald Trump. Oh my god. He just fucking broke Chris Hansen. The ball's on this Golden Globes member as he just lifts Chris Hansen again and just slams him on the ground. And already going for the pin, Trump really wants this guy down. Yeah, hey, Donald Trump. That's what he's thinking of. Yeah, hey, Donald Trump. You know, sometimes when I sing that song, I accidentally, I accidentally go Donald Trump. Like, I say that for some reason. And you know what? I'm going to keep doing that. One, because it's mocking Donald Trump's name, which always makes me happy. And two... Because it gave me an idea for a new wrestler, or at least an alternate costume for Donald Trump. Donald Trump, but he's dressed up as a giant shrimp. A.K.A. Donald Shrump. Yes, I am really going to make that thing, and the only reason I make that thing is because I think the name Donald Trump sounds hilarious. It may not sound hilarious to you, in fact it's just a really poorly done pun. But I'm sorry, to me it's hilarious, and because it's personally funny to me, I'm going to do it. I don't give a fuck what you think. Fuck what all you fans of AWS think. I only do this show for money, that's it, I don't do it to entertain people, that's just a fucking scam. I really hope you die of cancer, I hate every single one of you. Fuck the fans. I I'm just kidding, I was making a Keemstar reference, I don't actually hate all of you, the fact that 50 of you are willing to watch this 
weird ass show. That makes me happy. I, I love all of you. I was, it was, it was a joke. It was a jokey joke. So it was Super Zack Thunder's classic sarc sarcasm jokes. But anyway, I'm done with my tangents. Let's actually get into the match like, that I should be commentating as Chris Hansen is doing this awesome ass roll. Holy shit, Chris. Now the Predator Catcher is coming out. I think someone finally just informed him of all the weird allegations going against Trump. And now he's getting the stiff. And then Trump takes it away. Oh, wax him right in the torso. Oh, damn. He's whipping him with that stick. Jesus Christ, Trump. Oh, damn. The stick is a powerful weapon. Drops it. Picks it. Pick. Trump, why did you drop it just to pick it back up? Why didn't you just keep holding it? And he missed three times in a row. Trump, did you have a brain fart just then? Apparently, yeah, because now he's now he's actually taking the match seriously again. Seriously. I, I can grammar, I swear. I know what English is. Right? But nice comeback by Hansen as he picks Trump up. What's he gonna do? Trump no Trump Trump reverses it. And then another reversal. And what's this? Is this gonna be another reversal? Nope. The stick. It's back. God, you don't want to fuck with a guy who has the stick. It's the most powerful weapon in AWS. It's more powerful than the Super Duper Soldier Serum. So it combined with the guy with the Super Duper Soldier Serum, like Trump, it's does a lot of damage. However, he's fighting... Oh, no, wait. Chris Hansen has lower health than Trump. Oh, shit. Hansen, no. Come on, Hansen. You're my boy. Don't let the Predator win. Catch the Predator. Destroy the Predator, Hansen. Yes, use the stick. You're more powerful than the guy on fucking Super Duper Soldier Serum. So you with the stick. That should do enough damage. Come on. I mean, you missing there, that was hilarious, but I don't want you to miss. As Trump just throws him back at the ring, he wants to finish this now. Taking the stuff in there. Oh, and a nice reversal by Hansen as he just throws Trump into a fucking corner. Really hard, too. Like, ouch. Poor Trump's back. Oh! <laughs> and he punched him right in his Golden Globes. Trump's going to feel that in the morning. Especially when he gets the morning boner. He's really going to feel it when that happens. And then we get another Hercules punch. I mean, with Chris Hansen, though, you expect that. I mean, he's Chris fucking Hansen. He always has a Hercules punch up his sleeve. With Sal, it was actually shocking. Cause I, never seen, I never thought Sal would be the type for that. I don't know why he didn't just use that in the Tiger in the Impactful Jokers movie. Hansen, though, I mean, come on. He's Chris Hansen. Of course he has that. Apparently, he's also a fucking ninja, because what the hell was that? 2. D. And Chris Hansen wins. Yes. My boy, he's dead. Wait, wait. Did Trump just teleport back up? So, apparently, Trump is a wizard, as we get a few replays here of the fight. <sighs> nice move by Hansen. So, yes, my boy did it. The Predator Catcher has won against the Predator. The Predator has lost. And as punishment, I'm actually going to make Donald Trump's alternate costume, Donald Trump. Donald Trump's alternate costume, Donald Trump. Uh, yeah, I don't know what English is, ladies and gentlemen. But anyway, here he is. The Predator Catcher himself. He is the champion. And, like I said, next match, you're going to see Awesome Man. No, no, it not, no, you're not going to see Awesome Man. No, I was wrong about that. It's actually Blink Blink Boy versus... Another new competitor I created. This one all by myself. Uh, you probably already know who it is if you saw the uh, title screen for the tournament. But in case you haven't, I'm going to leave it a mystery for next episode. But anyway, on that note, whether you like it or not, that was the match. I've been your host, Super Duper Zachary Thunder. Er, 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 er. E to the R to the E to the R. And let's just say... Chris definitely made Trump have a C right over there. And Trump took the C took the bait, and now he's Donald Trump. Good night.